Next, game night coverage begins with the Elk and Elk Browns Countdown pregame show, followed by the Browns versus the Bengals and the Brownstown Live postgame show. Game night coverage is sponsored by Sarah Auto Park, Akron Canton's number one auto complex. From News 5, this is the Elk and Elk Browns Countdown pregame show. The sun setting on First Energy Stadium along the shores of Lake Erie, and with it, we hope setting on the memories of week one as well. The Browns home for the first time in this unprecedented 2020 season, and it's a primetime date with in-state rival Cincinnati. Right here on News 5, fans beginning to file inside First Energy, a stadium that holds nearly 70,000. We'll see just 6,000 tonight, but it is a home field advantage nonetheless. And the countdown is on. Just over an hour away from kickoff on this week two Thursday night football matchup between the Browns and Bengals. Welcome into the Browns countdown. I'm News 5 sports anchor John Doss, joined as I am every Sunday morning by a three-time Super Bowl champion, one half of the next level radio show on ESP in Cleveland. He is Gerard Cherry. Gerard, the Browns had arguably the most difficult week one assignment in the NFL on the road against one of the AFC's favorites in Baltimore, and it was not the type of debut Kevin Stefanski was hoping for. Good news, though, Gerard, no time to dwell. They play again tonight just four days later. Right, you certainly have to put this game behind you. Yes, it was a bad out coming for the Browns, but at the same time, John, you have another day, you have another opportunity to go out there and play football, hopefully at a much higher level, because you cannot take anything for granted in the National Football League. So if you're Kevin Stefanski, you tell your guys, put it behind you, move forward, but understand, we have to play better complimentary football if we want to get the job done and be a much improved football team in 2020. And there is Cody Parkey live. Remember, he was on this team uh, what, 2016, a handful of years ago. There he is warming up on the field at First Energy Stadium. Live pictures from the field out there, Gerard. Quick change here. What a difference now. New yeah, kicker. quick change. Yes, but you know, so I'm noticing those orange pants look nice, man. Uh, that's a professional transition, ah. something that we're going to talk about here shortly. All right, coming up after the break, we're going to talk with a Browns legend, future first ballot. Hall of Famer Joe Thomas. Plus, we'll mention a little bit about those pants that Gerard Cherry just brought up. It's Thursday Night Football, Browns and Bengals, week two, all that and more coming up next on the Browns Countdown pregame show. Just because the game is on Thursday night, do not forget, we still got you covered tonight after the ball game, Brownstown Live, 11.30. We also got you covered our regularly scheduled weekend programming. For Derek Forrest, Nathan Zagura, Gerard Cherry, I'm John Dawes. Thanks so much for watching. Enjoy the ball game here on News 5. This is Baker, a new quarterback rivalry in the AFC North, about to kick off as Thursday night football between the Bengals and the Browns starts right now exclusively on NFL Network. to NFL Game Day Kickoff, delivered by Pizza Hut. Welcome in, everybody, to NFL Game Day Kickoff. Shout out to Cleveland. Wish we were there with you in the Muni lot tonight, but we're all on a different journey together this season. One that's brought us to the Battle of Baker and Burroughs.